Hello friends, today I will tell you how to connect or how to use NIUSB 6009 DAC card for generating digital signal. For that purpose, first of all, you have to connect your NIUSB 6009 DAC card to your PC. When you connect this through the USB, it will blink as you see in the video. So, over here, I have a breadboard as you see. I just some jumping wire or you can say jumper wires. These are my male to male jumper wires and I have one LED. I just use it for generating a signal. Right now, I just generate a signal, digital signal using this NI6009 DAC card to glow the LED. So, just go to the software part. So, just create a new VI as you see over here. This is my VI. Now, I just go to NI DAC Max toolbox. So, in this toolbox, I just use different nodes. Just right click, measurement, input output, NI DAC Max. Just lock it. As you see, over here, this is my block diagram window, and this is my front panel window. So first, I just create channel. I want to work with digital signals. So just select digital output because I want to just generate a signal. Now, just drag and drop, start the task, connect it, error into error out. Now, I just want to write put over here next I want to stop the task connect it and I want to do it many times so that's why I just put a while loop over the writing task and the writing task is my digital writing so select Single channel, single sample, pull in line. Okay. So over here on the lines, just create a constant so that as you see over here, the name of the device is DEV1 port 0 line 0. If you want to check out what device is connected, you just go to NI Max. You can check your hardware device using this NI Max if it is some creating some problem. So I just go to NI Max. So over here in the device and interface just click over here. Here you get all the information regarding your system. Right now my system is Intel Core i3, 1.7 GHz speed. It is the information of my system. Okay. And over here, this is the NI device which is connected to my system. <clears throat> so over here, this is the serial number and it is present. If I disconnect it, as you see, it is not present. So I just connect it again. So now it is present. Okay. So <clears throat> I just close it. So right now I just use port 0, line 0 of device 1. Select it. And 
I just use a simple error handler from the dialog box if some error is there. Now you have to select or create signal. So I just use a push button. It will generate signal loop or false. Connect it. So over here, this is the signal for the LED and over here this is my control button to stop the loop. So this is my stopping button. I just use one LED, virtual LED to indicate the status inside the software. So over here this is my LED. So connect it. So when it is high, high signal goes to the outer world. When it is low, low signal goes to the outer world. Now go to the hardware part. As you see over here, in this case, P0.0. This is my port 0, line 0. So I just connect it with jumper wire. Over here, this is my line 0. Now I just need a ground signal also. So this is my ground signal as you see over here this is my LED it is my positive leg this is my negative leg just put over here. So this is my positive and this is my negative. Okay, so when you hit on run button, and signal is high, right now, port 0, line 0, So as you see, when it is high, signal goes high, when it is low, signal goes low. Okay, so this is how you can generate a digital signal using NI USB 6009 deck card. Thank you.